56 degrees out there right now, but look at some of the numbers up north. 49 Mount Clemens, 44 in Lapeer, 46 in Port Huron and Sandusky. We still have these uh, north northeast winds pumping drier air in that allows for numbers to bottom out a little bit more, cool off a little bit more. But later in the day, we'll get a more of a an east southeast wind. So we'll notice just a slight uptick in humidity. Not much. 62 at 8 a.m. 77 at noon and a high today of 82 showers late in the day. And I think even maybe tail end of the ball game. A's and Tigers 710 tonight and by about 10 p.m. We'll have some showers around as numbers will be falling back down through the 70s, but a nice night at the ballpark. We just really need to be watchful, uh, especially when you're watching uh, later editions of local four news at four five and six, of course, but we really do believe it's going to hold off until uh, after sunset. So hey, let's take a look at the model and see if that verifies. You can notice uh, through the afternoon. We're all right. There'll be some activity nearby through the late afternoon, but here's 11 p.m. and some showers starting to come in. But the bigger story is tomorrow. A very slow moving spinning area of low pressure keeps rain and thunder chances going. Could even see a an isolated stronger storm or two. And luckily we have a severe weather alert radio day at the Westland Meyer with uh, our friends at Midland radios. After Wednesday, the heat is on. On. We're near 90 Thursday, mid 90s Friday through Sunday with Friday, Saturday being the hottest muggiest of them all probably get a little relief on Sunday, starting with some wet weather, maybe the first half of your Sunday.